uh, when he talked about how he was uh, frustrated. I agree with him to a reasonable extent because... Uh, wait, 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 wait. You are going to watch the full video. But before you watch, let me explain something to you guys. Hey, this Junior Pope issue is not a small something. A lot of actors are coming out to say they are outside of it. So this um, man that you are about to watch, he was explaining how people were not uh, employing or taking Junior Pope for roles or to come and act movie. You know, you're going to watch for yourself. And I hope you guys already see the videos I've been uploading concerning Junior Pope. Update upon update. I don't want you guys to miss anything. So if you've not seen some of the updates concerning or related to what this man said, after watching this video, go check out my videos. And do not forget to subscribe to this channel for more updates oh yeah let's watch it together guys well uh, i just posted uh, pictures of junior pope and i um, i listened to frank tana when he talked about how he was uh, frustrated i agree with him to a reasonable extent because uh, in this our job you can actually be frustrated. But I make bold to say that uh, when I was producing, I was uh, the biggest producer in Worry. And the two biggest movies I've ever produced in my life, um, I used Junior Paul for them. One is The Vengeance of Bullet that won five awards. And uh, the other one is Flames of Love, far back 2010. Vengeance of Bullet cost me 8 million and Flames of Love 13 million. So you can imagine how big those movies were. And I was really hoping that Junior Pope would blow from those two movies. And since then, since I came to uh, Asaba, um, since 2018, up to January this year, I never worked with Junior Pope and I was wondering. And I kept asking him why we've not worked. We we'll just laugh. But in January, God bless Percy Adoki, who now paired us in a job at Agbo. I played uh, the role of uh, a Don, and uh, Junior Pope was my hitman. It was a very fine movie that is here to be released. So Frank, um, I'm one of those that actually featured uh, Junior Pope, and um, it's so, so unfortunate. I've bared my mind in the, our group, AMP group, Delta State, about my takeover of this. And I predicted that if producers don't change, they will witness more because they don't take safety seriously. Aside water movement, we go to very risky places and um, they don't provide security. We go to thick bushes to shoot. They don't provide security, uh, but I'm careful as a person because the last one we shot where I need to carry heavy weight, <laughs> I dodged it. So I advise uh, fellow artists, do the beat you can do. If you know it's too risky, don't do it. But I hope that um, the producers will learn from this and put unnecessary precautions in place anytime they want to shoot. Um, I don't want to wash our dirty linen in public, but we need to do a lot in Hollywood. We need to do a lot. Um, Junior Pope has sacrificed, the ultimate sacrifice, and I hope that uh, we'll make changes. On my part as uh, national patron of AGN, I will work with my chairman and also the president will make some suggestions to the president. And we need to enforce those things that uh, Emeka Rolas, um, our president, has put in place because the producers are still flouting them. They still work on Sundays when we are supposed to rest. They still work us late into the night without caring for the um, safety of the cast and crew, all that need to change. Some of us need to take the bull by the horn and tell them the truth. No matter whose ox is God, 
you know, like Tana came out to speak, I think we all need to speak up. If they don't want to give us jobs again, we all retire to our homes and um, farm. <laughs> yes, we all can farm, you know, but the truth must be told. Junior Pope, rest in peace.